Now, this ayah is very important. This has declared and this was foretold, you know, what had been happening to Jews even you know, ever since. It's only from 1917 of this century that the things were changed. When after the Balfour Declaration, they were allowed to purchase land and settle down in Palestine. After how much period? They were scattered in the land, in the whole of the world. Uh, after the year 70 of Christian era, when Titus, you know, he conquered Jerusalem, he demolished the second temple, he killed hundreds and thousands of the Jews, and then the Jews were expelled from Palestine. From 70, year 70 of Christian era to 1917, just imagine, 1837 years, they were all, you know, this is called diaspora, scattered. And we just scattered them in the whole of the world, in the whole of the earth, in communities. Now, this was the decision of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and we had in this very century, at least the people of my age, they know what happened, you know, in Germany. They say six million of them were exterminated. Some people doubt this figure, but they also say that at least four million were killed. Special, you know, plants were designed how to dispose of their bodies, a big number, you know, gas chambers and all those things designed specially. They have been having punishments and punishments and punishments and punishments at the hands of the Christians. You know, I, I have written a book to Christians with love and I have given, you know, the detail. There has been bitter enmity between the Christians and the Jews. It was only after Renaissance and the reformation of religion, when, you know, Christianity was divided into Catholicism and Protestantism, that they got the support of the Protestants. They have just recently, so to say, conquered the Catholics also, when the you know, Pope has granted them amnesty, that they are not responsible for the crucifixion of Jews. And, you know, Vatican has also recognized Israel, and the Pope is going to visit Israel very soon. And, you know, the, the embassy of uh, Israel will be built and that, that will be in Jerusalem. This is the diaspora, which they call the period of diaspora. We scattered them in the whole of the world. Obaman, in community, the community here, the community there. Some Jews living in Russia, some Jews, you know, migrated to America, some here, some there. They were all scattered. This is what they call diaspora. But here Quran is doing justice to them. There are among them good people are also. And they are the reverse also. And we have been trying them with good blessings and misfortunes. Maybe that they return. They repent to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. But then after them there succeeded unworthy generations. Warisul Kitab, they inherited the book. You know, this book is inherited. We have also inherited Quran from Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa generation after generation. Sahaba got it from the Prophet. Then the Tabin got it from the companions and so on. Then the Tabi Tabin got it. And this is in, in the inheritance, you know, coming. Warisul Kitab, they inherited the book. Ya Khudun al Adna. And they would accept. The things of this low world, as has been said, you know, many a time, selling the revelations of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, selling the fatwas, you know, for some worldly gains, meager gains. The same that we also say, oh, we shall be pardoned, we shall be forgiven, Allah will forgive us. We have a special, special relationship with him. We are the children of Ibrahim. We are this, like sons to Allah and the very beloved of him. And we also say, we are the Ummah of Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. No, the, the, the fire of hell cannot touch us. Even if, if it touches us, it will be for only a few days, only a number of days. 
وَإِن يَاتِهِمْ عَرَضُ الْمِسْلُهُ يَاخُذُهُ And if you know this worldly gains come to them, they again take it. أَلَمْ يُوْخَذْ عَلَيْهِمْ نِسَاقُ الْكِتَابِ Was not the covenant of book taken from them? خُذُوا مَا عَتَيْنَاكُمْ بِقُوَّتِمْ وَذْكُرُوا مَا فِيهِ لَعَلَّكُمْ تَتَّقُونَ Allah yaqulu ala Allah illa al-haq. The covenant was that they will never say on Allah except what is true. They will never concoct something, forge something and attribute it to Allah. Wa darasu maafi. And they have been reading. They have been studying this book. They have been having this book with them. Wa darul akhiratu khairul lil ladhina yattaqoon. But the house of the akhirah, of the hereafter. The life of the hereafter. That is much better for those who have taqwa. Afala taqilun. So don't you have your intelligence and you don't use your intelligence or intellect? Wallazina yumasikuna bil kitab. Those who cling to the book. Hold fast to the book. This is the book of Allah. Hold fast. Wa atasimu bihablillahi jamiyah. Tamasuk. I'tisam. Having the same meanings. وَالَّذِينَ يُمَسِّكُونَ بِالْكِتَابِ وَأَقَامُ السَّلَاةَ And they established the prayers in the Allah Ruzi وَجْرَ الْمُسْلِحِينَ We are not going to waste the rewards of the righteous and the reformers. وَإِنَّتَقْنَ الْجَبَلَ فَوْقَهُمْ كَانَّهُ ذُلَّهِ And we had, when we had just, recall when we had raised and shook the mountain over their heads, كَانَّهُ ذُلَّهِ As if it was a canopy. وَزَنُّوا أَنَّهُ وَاقِعٌ بِهِمْ And they thought and feared that it is going to fall upon them. خُذُوا مَا تَيْنَاكُمْ بِقُوَّةٍ This was the covenant of the book. Now hold fast to what we have given. And the same misaq was taken from us also as we have read in Surah Al-Ma'idah. So that is misaq. Misaq al-Kitab. Misaq al-Torah. Misaq al-Quran. We are bound the misaq of Quran. The covenant of Quran. وَإِذْ نَتَقْنَ الْجَبَلَ فَوْقَهُمْ كَأَنَّهُ ذُلَّ وَذَنُّوا أَنَّهُ وَاقِعُمْ بِهِمْ خُذُوا مَا عَتَيْنَاكُمْ بِقُوَّةٍ وَاسْكُرُوا مَا فِيهِ And remember whatever is there in it. لَعَلَّكُمْ تَتَّقُونَ So that you will have taqwa, so that you will be saved from the punishment of the hereafter, from the displeasure of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Now another incident which happened, you know, in the beginning of the creation. I told you this surah is giving, most part of it is devoted. To history, events, incidents, Ambao Rusul, you know, major part of it, about 15 sections out of total 24, they are dedicated to the Ambao Rusul. Then you know in the beginning, the story of Iblis and Adam, then what will happen at the end of this world, in the, in the hereafter. Now again an incident which took place, it is very important. وَإِذَا خَذَ رَبُّكَ مِنْ بَنِي آدَمَ مِنْ زُهُورِهِمْ زُرِّيَتَهُ May I just recall, when your Lord drew out from the backs of all the Bani Adam, and you know, what was drawn out? The souls. Not, you know, not the human beings. You can't draw out a full man from the back of the father. You know, only the soul can be drawn out. وَأَشْهَدَهُمْ عَلَىٰ أَنفُسِهِمْ and then he made them witness on their own selves. Alastu bi rabbikum. Am I not your Lord, your, your master, your creator, your sustainer? Kalu bala. They said, why not? Surely. Shahidna. We are, we bear testimony to it. We are witnesses to it. Antakulu yawm al qiyamah. Lest you should say on the day of judgment, on the day of resurrection, Inna kunna an hadha ghafileen. Well, we were unaware of this. When this misaq was taken from us. No. Your souls remember them. And when Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will take us to account on the basis of this misaq, this covenant, you know, the souls will remember those things. And Hazrat Ali has been reported to have said, that I remember the covenant when it was taken from me. Because most of us, you know, our souls are lying buried under the debris of our animal being. So it is, so to say, unconscious. It is not remembering. Had we purified our souls and had we strengthened our soul, souls, then they would remember that this was the covenant that they made with Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. 
او تقولو انما عشق آباؤن او لس یو شوڈ سی دیٹ ایکچولی اور فور فادرز دے ایسوسیٹڈ گاڈ ود اللہ من قبل بفور اس وکلنا ذریعت من بعد ایمن وی ور دیر پروجنی وی ور فالوین دیم افتحلکنا بما فعل المبتلون سو او اللہ آر یو گوئی تو ڈیسٹروائی اس بیکاز آف دی مسڈیڈز آف دوز پیپل دے کمیٹیڈ دی سیرر وی ور دیر پروجنی وی فالوڈ بٹ دے آر دی اوریجنیٹرز آف دی سن سو آر یو گوئنگ ٹو کل اس اینڈ ڈسٹروائی اس اینڈ پنیش اس آن اکاؤنٹ آف دی انوینٹرز آف دی فال ہوس فال ہوڈ دے ور دی انوینٹرز بٹ یو نو اللہ وڈ سے اوکے یو آر سن آف سچ اینڈ سچ پرسن ہی واز سن آف سچ اینڈ سچ پرسن بٹ اباؤٹ یور سول اٹ واز ناٹ دی سن آف یور فادر اٹ ہیڈ نو ریلیشن شپ اٹ واز ڈائریکٹلی فرام می یہ سلون اکانی روح کل روح میں نمبر ربی سو یو کان ٹیک دس پلی باڈی لی یور اینیمل ایگزسٹینس یور باڈیز دے کیم فرام دی فادر اینڈ دی مدر اینڈ دی باڈیز آف دی فادر اینڈ دی مدر دے کیم فرام یو نو یو نو یور گرینڈ فادر گرینڈ مدر بٹ وٹ اباؤٹ یور سولس دے آر سیپریٹ ایبسولیوٹلی سیپریٹ ایز وی ہیو یو نو دی حدیث فرام عبد اللہ ابن مسعود رضی اللہ تعالی عنہ دیٹ ایچ ون آف یو ان دی ووم آف ہز مدر ہی ریمینس فورٹی ڈیز نوتفا اینڈ فورٹی ڈیز بزغا Another, another, another 40 days, Muzga. After these 120 days, Allah sends the angel and he breathes into him the soul. The soul which was created by before. Now he becomes a human being. وَكَذَلِكَ نُفَصِّلُ الْآيَاتِ وَلَعَلَّهُمْ يَرْجِعُونَ And this is how we detail our ayat and revelations. We explain them so that they return to the truth. 